You have entered the Chronics rabbit hole and Chronicans, welcome back to the channel. My name is Alana. My name is Kyle. And I am so excited to be back with all of you as Angelina Jordan is making her way down the rabbit hole once again with a new video only released nine hours ago as of the making of this video. And her song, uh, not even song, it's Angelina Jordan, 10 years in the making. Alana's excited, I'm excited, are you as excited? Let's find out. I am so excited to finally get here because while I was scrolling through YouTube this morning, this video showed up saying it had only been released 38 minutes from the time that I saw it. True. So I have been waiting nine hours to get into this video. I'm so excited to be here with Angelina Jordan's 10 years in the making. Go to her channel, please, if you haven't done so already. Give this a like, give her a follow, show her some love and some support because Angelina Jordan is absolutely gorgeous absolutely is i have loved every single song that she has done that we have reacted to please go check out all of them this is 10 years in the making y'all let's see why heidi's about to slam something it looks like let's see what it is <laughs> cool this is like official too yeah. on her channel And that moment of performing wow. for the first time on stage, I was like, I knew She's that changed. my music was bigger than myself. Wow, well said. This one clip just went viral of Gloomy Sunday and everything really like changed in a way that I never expected it. At some point I just couldn't go to school because you know, I had people Jeez. from, uh, LA flying to my school to like, they were just curious. They were like, is this girl real? Like she's just, she's just seven years old. Wow, a seven. Paparazzi at your elementary school. Oh my God, wow. Wow. We're caught in a trap. This is so beautiful. I could not do it without them. Yeah, family. You know, you're not only family, but they know you deep down inside, like, like no other and so it's so so important that's that that is in the right place what you doing to me oh, this is gorgeous before she starts uh, speaking again and that was so cute to see how like her little sister came up for a hug and she's like i love you but grandma yeah that was like i i understand that to my heart so I was just thinking oh, too, man. just like how strong her family is. And then literally she just took it out of my mouth. And this is just so beautifully done already. Beautiful yes. music behind it, this black and white. It really is a big deal. And for her to say her music was bigger than her yes, already at that age. That's There's... why they were flying to see like, are you real? Absolutely. To... Because like, I've seen a lot of seven year olds do great on America's Got Talent yeah. throughout the years. So, and Angelina Jordan, she's something special. Phenom. She's a phenomenon with this, and this is just insane, and she just explained why. Yeah, here we go. You know, it's, it's not only about creating music, it's just your identity, uh, your style, everything, and with the yeah. support they've been given me, and the uh, I, I want them to always be my shield. Was, yeah, was very wine amy winehouse absolutely style. was and i love it very amy winehouse style i got that right and build our dreams on suspicious minds if 
When I first found out what, what music was at the age of like one and a half, it was just like something that I just couldn't get enough of. So I just, I don't know, I felt like it really came to me more than anything else. And I mean, ever since I discovered like the different genres and everything, I was just like, I was obsessed. I just couldn't get enough. Yeah, she has a range of musical taste. She sure does. I think it's an honor to be compared to like those legendary artists like sure Adele is. and Amy Winehouse. I I truly look up to them. Wow. With, for you example, how you know Adele has really Adele, that's cool to know. Hasn't really been changing anything with how she is, and I think that also that inspires me a lot. So She's got like an Elvis aura. Yes, she does. Oh my gosh, what she, is like, going on here? She embodies Adele, Amy Winehouse. She's got the Elvis aura. She is like she is a superstar Literally. in her soul. Oh my gosh, because not everyone could pull this off. Like just the simplicity of this style of a video is so awe inspiring because of how great she really is. Absolutely. <laughs> So we're all the way um, to Westgate. I having my first ever Vegas show tonight, um, wow. and I am beyond honored yes, and excited. And we're about to go um, to do a sound check, and then I have a meet and greet, and hair and makeup got to be done, and then show. Wow. It's not I'm that like I get nervous, it's more that of that excitement, yeah. like that Game time. Um, that moment that you're just like waiting for, uh, like starting the show and seeing all the beautiful people uh, coming from all around the world. So it's more, mm. it's more of, uh, like that waiting feeling, like, oh my God, I'm so ready. And just, I've had a lot of preparation, so I feel super ready. Good. And we are about to see your big poster, Angelina. Oh my what, God! What, what did it oh. feel like when you saw it? Oh for the first my time? gosh! I was, I was so surprised. It was wow. so funny to. I'm like, oh, that's me. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, it, was, it was amazing. I feel really humbled and yeah. yeah. What a so I'm just super, so so happy to have my first ever Vegas show. It's uh, it's it's truly an honor. That's big time. Are they going to show it? They have to show it. They have to. That's why you prep. That's why you yes. prepare. Because when you prepare and opportunity comes, that's what success is. It's not just luck, y'all. It's she's saying she's not nervous because she's prepped. She's done her work. Even Kobe Bryant, he'll say, I'm not nervous before a game because I've done my studying. Absolutely. So I'm not I'm ready for the show. She wants to perform. She knows people are flying to see her. It's mesmerizing this is. This is insane. Yeah. I love this. I'm loving the music behind. Yeah, I love the black and white. So much. This is like next level. Excuse me, old school, you know, yeah. movie real, rock and roll. Like this is everything. Bringing every generation into one. Absolutely. I mean everything that Elvis has done. Stop. 
it just inspires me so much. And everything that Elvis has done, it just inspires me so much from no kidding. his style, his music. I, uh, I've done so many. What I tend to do is I love doing Oh, my own renditions of cover songs. Yeah, she sure has her own renditions. God, those are cool. I like that. Let's get the drum and drum. One, two, three. Wow. Drums, drums will need more bass. It's on the backpack. <laughs> so cool. Make some noise for Jay Flatto, saxophone, ladies and gentlemen. Amazing. Come on, little trombone. Come on, hit me on the horn. Yeah, you got caught. Thank <laughs> <laughs> you. There, there isn't one second that I'm not lis listening to music, uh, but it really comes to me all the time because I, I do write in my journal every day about like everything happening in life and just people that I meet, experiences. I mean, I've been traveling the whole world. Smart. If you're an when I'm at so the bad. piano, I'll, I'll read through these stuff and I really get inspired. When all the musicians were playing around there, I thought I heard the little boy crying in the background or at least saying something, and it was correct. Our baby Oliver had just woken up. We know Angelina Jordan is so about family, so mm -hmm. it's good that we had to stop to make sure the baby was okay. The older brother, Avery, is now babysitting for us so that we can finish this amazing documentary of the so 10 nice. years. We are exactly halfway through, so it's a perfect time to kind of reflect and what a perfect shot to get right back into this. I'm so excited, and I have to say I love her glowing heels on her shoes. Yeah, it works like, so good for this. So good. Such a statement piece. It really is, especially in the black and white. Mm -hmm. Even though they're going to not see in black and white. Here we go. Stuff, and I really get inspired. Live in concert. Bring it on, my heart is strong. There's nothing I won't do. And this proves it. Oh, oh, nice. When I first saw her on, on I forgot what I saw her on. I was like, wow, this girl's going to be something when she grows up. And I just followed her ever since. I've been following her for three years now. Wow. And I'm addicted. So I guess I'm a groupie. <laughs> She's a groupie. So I actually told my boss that um, I'm moving today, which I moved last week. Um, I took off work for this and uh, nobody knows I'm here. My family doesn't know. My work doesn't know. I, I skipped. They all know now. Literally just, I, I lied to come to this. Now. Wow! That's her actual style that she would want. This is, of course, Abbey Road from the Beatles. So we have Billie Holiday, her main influence, Elvis, uh, Angelina, and the third position, Paul McCartney was barefoot in, in the Abbey Road yeah. crossing, and then Grandma Mary. We are from New York City and we are so excited to see Angelina perform. We love you. You are amazing. And an inspiration to all. Beautiful person. Sold out. And sold out. Wow. wow. Real quick, it just shows the people that she has hit because she is, like I said, every she brings every generation together with she her does. music. Absolutely. When did you get this tattoo? <laughs> Brazil. So it's Brazil. Oh, this is the from Brazil. Yeah. Wow, and you too? My wife. Are husband. you as big of a fan? Big of a fan. Aww. <laughs> There's no you, no me, at least. That's how I feel. I'm 
Oh, I said that dress is very reminiscent of like Marilyn Monroe's like un iconic dress. Right. Okay. With yeah, like yeah. the diamonds and like how it's very form fitting and everything. At least in black and white, that's what's reminding me of. That's fair enough. And if she does this Kanye West cover too, oh my God, she would kill on this song. <laughs> I love you more, Julia, if you never heard you. <laughs> <laughs> Just love for my no stuff. Finding you is easy. Cause I'll carry you with me. Ain't no mountain high. And I'm not gonna climb. No river is too high. Valley too low. The places that I go. Fire rain. Keep throwing on my way. I know how much I can say. I get stronger from the pain. The legendary wall at the West Gate. I think she's just signed all the way across the top. She's at the top. Oh, 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 Looking back. Oh my 
Uh, okay, we're so close, y'all. Here we go. Back to the 10 years of my career. It's been over there. Looking back to the 10 years of my career, I am just so grateful for my loyal fans who have been supporting me since day one and given all the love and support that has made me never ever want to stop and not only stop with what I love, but never stop with what I'm dreaming of and to write more music and to have the ability and, and a voice for others uh, to inspire. I mean, that to me is a gift that I will forever be so, so grateful of. Um, but I also want to say that each and every one of you inspire me to be the best version of myself. Just like, are you kidding me? Thank you for waiting to watch this with me, honey. Wow. She really is such a genuine human and a genuine soul. If there's one person I'd want to talk to, it might be her. Wow. Yeah. Wow. And See, that's I'm only thinking. 10 years, y'all. Think how much more time she has to grow and to show and... We know she could probably do any genre, cover anything, and it's just time that she has to now Absolutely. go and explore so many avenues. She already can tell she's not sold out at all. She's just established already, and it sounds like if you're already established in your first generation, you're seven years old, you're already in, people are coming, and then you get to see this growth of not getting flustered by fame, but yes. actually becoming more humbled by it. Absolutely. Which is a whole different way, and then... A lot of these people that she's admired, a couple of them at least, not maybe not a lot of them passed away through the rock star lifestyle and all that and other demons and stuff. And she seems like she has such a good family to keep her sane yes. and to keep her with just incredible support and the shield that she mentioned. And we're just so much about family here. Alana's pregnant herself and we yes. potentially have a baby <laughs> girl, baby boy. We don't know. We're actually keeping that secret. So, but that that thought of what a girl really is and then seeing the young Angelina is just so beautiful because there's something so pure about um, just honesty. Really, I think, and that's what I think of the her. It's just the of honesty children of her. And yeah. What they kind of go through because I love what she said about being an inspiration to all the new generations and being a voice for those who can't have their own voice yeah and a lot of times with these young children like we saw that video of her playing the little red ukulele so and singing cute. right and she was Rolling just a child the just singing and, and just loving life yeah and there's so many times that children will be in that moment singing and loving their life but they won't have the support that to keep going and to keep practicing and to polish it and to be able to become something. Yeah. A lot of, unfortunately, a lot of parents, a lot of people tend just go like, oh, look how cute they are. They're trying to sing. And or they, even or, be quiet. Or I just need be some quiet. quiet. I need right my now. peace and quiet while they're on their phone. Yeah. But to see how grounded Angelina is with, with her family, even inviting her sister to go, come on stage. I believe her sister is Juliet. The girl who she called out, I think I heard you when someone said, I love you. Oh, I thought that was someone in the crowd saying, like, I love you. Angela. Yeah, and I think that was her sister in the oh, crowd okay. watching. That's fair enough. That's but fair I enough. don't know. So correct me if I'm wrong. But then her sister coming out and like we're pulling her back on onto the stage for that encore, for that bow. Okay. And then her bowing with her sister there with the whole band. For me, that really shows like that genuine connection yeah, that absolutely. he has with her family and that support system that she has. Her sister loves her, eh? Yes, she does, yeah. absolutely. And that so that's such a tight knit um, um, group. I think that really is what gives her the ability to have the soul of the of Elvis and Amy Winehouse and all of these amazing artists that died way too young due to this rock star lifestyle, where she can express that soul, be that voice, and be that inspiration without getting into the dark side of it because she has that safety net within her family her yeah, sister and yeah. her grandma and her mother there 
and it's it's beautiful to see it really is if anyone's worried about music going forward i think with the accessibility of now being able to go on the internet and really check out music at at any time for as long yes. as you want she says she's listening to music all the time all the time that's why all the generations love all this new younger talent that's coming out and it's really it's happy for me because it means this music's going to yes. go to a whole nother level because of people like angelina jordan Absolutely. that is embodying all the the best parts of musicals past and bringing a new twist to it to move forward because Absolutely. even all of her covers they're so unique. They are like even that totally Bohemian unique. Rhapsody one that yes. she started doing there. You saw Simon's just like, what? How do you keep? How how am I getting flawed by this song again? Like yeah. that's why. And I I don't remember what what was the first one we saw of her. It was like that. Oh, from that the old school one. Oh my goodness, with the um um, the crazy guy who sings. Yeah. Oh man, what was the name of that? I, song? I put a spell on you. I put a spell on you. Yeah, I put a spell on you. That was like the first time we saw her, and yes. seeing now this ten year journey, and we ha maybe haven't seen all those snippets, but it makes us need to go see even more. Absolutely. So please let us know which way we should move forward with this Angelina Jordan. This was an absolute treat. Hopefully, you all had a good time with us as well. Hit the like button if you did, and please go to Angelina Jordan's channel to go subscribe to her. I know she deserves it as Absolutely. well. Absolutely. We are now exiting the rabbit hole, folks. Thank you, everyone, so much for being here and for watching this with us for the first time. I have waited for this amazing documentary all day and I finally got to see it so I'm really excited because it really shows just how much of an inspiration she is not just what we've been saying she is from seeing her videos but yeah. to see her soul her come mouth. through this from her own mouth from her own production this is absolutely phenomenal I can't wait to see where Angelina is going to go in the future peace and love everyone was it worth the wait I hope it was worth the wait good god bless y'all take care and bye for now don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more Enter the Chronicness. Special thanks to all of our YouTube, Patreon, and Buy Me a Coffee members. Thank you for all of your support. Thank you so much for making it all the way to the very end of the video. And if you have not yet done this, here's an easy way to subscribe to our channel. And if you want to subscribe to the artists that you just heard, here's an easy way to do that as well. And if you are also interested in finding a video that you might like, just click here. Thank you so much for coming to the channel. Peace and love, everyone. God bless y'all. Take care. Bye for now.